problem solve and they have given the problem as in solve y double dash plus 4 y dash plus 4 y is equals to 4 cos x plus 3 sin x with initial condition they have given y of 0 is equals to 0 y dash of 0 is equals to 0 this means this value it's as an x value this value it's x value and this value is y value when your x is equals to 0 the y value is equals to 0 when x is equals to 0 when y dash value is equals to 0 by seeing this we are we can identify when the rules which it will go to which rule because here they have given us an cos x and sin x so this will go to the rule second first find the complementary function first write down the given equation in the operator form operator form d square plus 4d plus 4 of y it's equals to 4 cos x plus 3 sin x auxiliary equation auxiliary equation from auxiliary equation we are going to get a roots based on that roots we are going to write a complementary function m square plus 4m plus 4 it's equals to 0 this is in the form of a plus a b whole square we can write this equation as m plus 2 whole square it's equals to 0 m plus 2 m plus 2 it's equals to 0 m plus 2 it's equals to 0 m plus 2 is equals to 0 m is equals to minus 2 m is equals to minus 2 therefore the roots are real and repeated therefore the roots are real and repeated twice so our complementary function will be the cf y sub x is equals to c1 plus c2 x e to the power of m x where m1 x wherever m values they we got m values is equals to as in minus 2 comma minus 2 so we are going to have y c is equals to c1 plus c2 x e to the power of minus 2 x now we have to find the complementary function when we will write complementary function plus particular integral we are going to get as a general solution first half of the problem is over we have find the cf now we have to find pi it's to pi it's equals to 1 by f of d into x where f of d is equals to d square plus 4 d plus 4 where x is equals to 4 cos x plus 3 sin x then multiply this 1 by f of d to each and every term of the x where x is equals to 4 cos x plus 3 sin x we are going to have 1 by d square plus 4 d plus 4 4 cos x plus 1 by d square 1 by d square plus 4 d plus 4 3 sin x where here a where for this here a is equals to 1 even here a is equals to 1 here a is equals to 1 we have to substitute we have to keep d square is equals to minus of a square where a is equals to where a is equals to 1 so d square is equals to minus of 1 square is equals to minus 1 substitute it's equals to 1 by minus 1 plus 4d plus 4 4 cos x plus 1 by minus 1 plus 4d 
प्लस फोर थ्री साइन एक्स इट्स इक्वल्स टू एज एन वन बाई फोर डी प्लस थ्री फोर कॉस एक्स प्लस वन बाई फोर डी प्लस थ्री थ्री साइन एक्स नाउ वी कैन नॉट सब्सिट्यूट द डी वैल्यू हेयर बिकॉज डी इज इमेजनरी सो वी आर गोइंग टू रेशनलाइज इट वन बाय फोर डी प्लस थ्री इंटू फोर डी माइनस थ्री बाय फोर डी माइनस थ्री फोर कॉस एक्स हियर वेन वी आर रेशनलाइजिंग इफ दिस टर्म इज प्लस इन रेशनलाइजिंग द मल्टीप्लाइंग एंड न्यूमिनेटर एंड डिनोमिनेटर वी गोइंग टू गेट इट एज एन माइनस विद अ कॉन्जुगेट पेट्स प्लस वन बाय फोर डी प्लस थ्री इंटू फोर डी माइनस थ्री बाई फोर डी माइनस थ्री इंटू थ्री साइन एक्स फोर डी माइनस थ्री बाई सिक्सटीन डी स्क्वेर माइनस नाइन फोर कॉस एक्स प्लस फोर डी माइनस थ्री बाई सिक्सटीन डी स्क्वेर माइनस नाइन थ्री साइन एक्स यू हियर एज एन ए अगेन यू गोइंग टू सब्सिट्यूट डी स्क्वेर इज इक्वल टू माइनस ऑफ ए स्क्वेर वी आर गोइंग टू हैव फोर डी माइनस थ्री बाई सिक्सटीन ऑफ माइनस वन माइनस नाइन फोर कॉस एक्स प्लस फोर डी माइनस थ्री फोर डी माइनस थ्री सिक्सटीन ऑफ माइनस वन माइनस नाइन थ्री साइन एक्स इट्स इक्वल्स टू फोर डी माइनस थ्री फोर कॉस एक्स प्लस फोर डी माइनस थ्री थ्री साइन एक्स होल डिवाइडेड बाय माइनस ट्वेंटी फाइव Because here I got minus twenty five and here as in minus twenty five, so I have written as in four d minus three four cos x plus four d minus uh, three three sine uh, three x. Now multiply this four cos uh, x to each and every term of the bracket and three sine x to each and every term of the bracket. Where d stands for where d stands for differentiation d by d x four d. Four, four into four. That will give as in sixteen. Sixteen d cos x minus twelve cos x plus four into three. Twelve d sin x minus nine sin x whole divided by minus twenty five. Where the differentiation of cos is equals to minus sin and differentiation of sin is equals to cos x we going to get as in minus 16 sin x then minus 12 cos x plus 12 cos x minus 9 minus 9 sin x by minus 25 Where the differentiation of d by dx into cos x is equals to minus sin x, and d by dx sin x is equals to cos x. So we will get as in this cos x and uh, plus twelve cos x got cancelled. We are left with minus twenty five sin x by minus twenty five. This twenty five and this twenty five get cancelled. That is equals to as in sin x, where p i is equals to sin x. G s general solution is equals to complementary function plus particular integral. Y is equals to where we got our complementary function as in c one plus c two x e to the power of minus two x minus two x plus Sine x. Along with this, we will take this as an equation one. 
because here we have to find the constant values they have given the initial conditions they have given given initial condition as x is equals to 0 y is equals to 0 x is equals to 0 y dash is equals to 0 here we are having as in differentiation so we are going to differentiate the equation 1 of equation 1 we are going to have it as in y dash is equals to to this we are going to use as in uv where uv is equals to where uv uv formula is equals to u dash v plus u v dash we will get it here as in minus 2 of c1 plus c2 x e to the power of minus 2 x plus where the first term i am not having any here i am not having any x term so this term become as in 0 here i am having as an x so i am going to get the second term as in c2 e to the power of minus 2x where the differentiation of sine as in plus cos x this will take it as an equation 2 now we will apply the given initial conditions to equation 1 and 2 where the initial condition x is equals to 0 when when x is equals to 0 y value is equals to 0 x is equals to 0 y dash is equals to 0 substitute in equation 1 and 2 we are going to have it as 0 it's equals to c1 plus c2 of 0 e to the power of minus 2 of 0 plus sine plus sine 0 it's equals to 0 is equals to c1 c1 value is equals to 0 where sine 0 is equals to 0 e to the power of 0 is equals to 1 and c2 of 0 is equals to 0 so c1 value is equals to 0 now substitute the second condition in equation 2 where the second condition as an x is equals to 0 y dash is equals to 0 0 is equals to minus 2 of c1 plus c2 of 0 e to the power of minus 2 of 0 plus c2 e to the power of minus 2 of 0 plus cos 0 0 is equals to minus 2 c1 plus c2 where cos 0 is equals to as in 1 where we are having the c1 value is equals to 0 so substitute that c1 value is equals to 0 0 is equals to 0 plus c1 plus c sorry c2 plus 1 where c1 is equals to 0 we got this uh, on substitution of first condition in the first equation where c2 plus 1 is equals to 0 c2 is equals to minus 1 now substitute these values in the general solution gs where y is equals to c1 is equals to 0 plus c2 is equals to minus 1 x e to the power of minus 2 x plus sin x y is equals to minus x e to the power of minus 2 x plus sin x this is the required solution if you are having any doubts ask in a comment if you got the procedure clearly like it and subscribe it thank you